Hello everyone, I am back with a new video and for today's video I will be showing you guys what I'm gonna be making myself for dinner. Now it's not um, anything super complicated, it's just a chipotle chicken sandwich. I think that's what I'm gonna go with. Um, and I know that's so freaking basic so please don't judge me. But it's something I had a few years back. Um, I'm pretty positive my friend Joanna brought that over, brought the sandwich over, and I really, really liked it. So I made it a little while after that, and I haven't had it since. So I'm going to be making it today. First, I'm going to go pick up the things from Publix to make it. Um, I'll see what else I pick up, and then I will be showing you guys how I make it. And yeah. As far as cooking goes, I am not the best cook. I know how to make a few simple things, but I would like to become a better cook. So who knows? I might make similar videos in the future with better, making better stuff, I guess, or more complicated stuff. Um, I'm going to take a quick shower before I head out. So next time you guys see me, I will be looking a little different. Oh, here we are at Publix Food and Pharmacy, and I'm just trying to be careful not to record anyone for their own privacy. Yeah. Oh, shoot. Now we are over here at the deli, and there's lots of meats and cheeses, and the chipotle chicken is somewhere over there to the left, but yeah. All right, you guys. I am back from Publix. Now I'm just going to show you guys everything I got. So while I was already there, I went ahead and picked up some more yogurt. It's just a plain, same plain yogurt. But this time it's the Danon brand. And of course, this is for my smoothies, as you know from my last video. I also went ahead and got some strawberries, finally, and some more mangoes, again, for the smoothies. But now on to what I will be eating today. So for the bread, I got this. It is the Chicago Italian bread made from scratch daily. That's what that says. And it looks like that comes in slices. I prefer this one. The other one is fine, but I just think this one tastes better. And this was $2.99 if you want to keep track of how much my food was. And then for the cheese that I will be adding to the sandwich, I got some boar's head um, cheese. It's just Munster cheese. And this was $5, which is a little bit on the pricey side. But I feel like I could have easily done with half of this. So I could have paid $250 if I only got half of it instead of, you know, this. Um, so yeah. So yes, it's expensive, but it could have been less. And like I said, this is just Munster cheese. And then we also got that Chipotle chicken that I was talking about. This is just called Chipotle chicken breast. And this was actually $10, which once again, kind of pricey. But this is for a pound. I feel like if um, two people for one night could easily order half a pound and be fine. Which would come out to like five bucks. But yeah, it was ten bucks for a whole pound. And that's like enough to make you, I don't know, like ten, maybe eight to ten sandwiches. But um, yeah, I got a pound and it was ten bucks. So for condiments, I just got this small thing of mayonnaise. I'm not a huge, huge fan of mayonnaise, but... A little bit is fine, so I'll just be adding um, a little bit to the sandwich. And then for my little appetizer, I got um, a cucumber and two limes. And what I will be doing is just peeling this, slicing it, um, and then squeezing the lime juice from these two onto the chopped up pieces. And then I'll be sprinkling a little bit of salt, not too much, and it'll be good. And then lastly for my drink, I just got this vitamin water and it, this is the dragon fruit flavor. Um, I usually don't like the zero calorie vitamin waters or anything with like zero calories or artificial sweeteners. I don't tend to take very well. They make my stomach hurt. But this one only has, um, this one's the 100 calorie version and this one is pretty good. Uh, this is probably my only favorite vitamin water or the only vitamin water that i like so yeah i'd recommend it it's a dragon fruit one 100 calories it's really good all right you guys now i'm just gonna peel the cucumbers prepare them make my sandwich and then i'll show you guys the finished product all right you guys so here's the final um 
I don't know, final product. So here are my cucumbers, like I said, with uh, chopped up cucumbers, lime juice, a little bit of salt, and that's it. And then the Chipotle chicken sandwiches, which are these um, bread that I mentioned earlier. I forgot the name of it, actually. But if you um, go back in the video, I mentioned it. Um, and then the Chipotle chicken, Munster cheese, a little bit of mayonnaise, and that's it. And of course, my vitamin water, um, the dragon fruit one. And that's about it. Bone apple tea. All right, you guys. So that about wraps up this video. I hope I didn't make anyone too hungry, if that even looked appealing to you. Now I'm just going to go enjoy my meal and enjoy the rest of my night. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, like always, I'll see you in my next one. Take care and peace out.